it's almost time. In the next few days, our brand new, fully instructional 2021 video training series for Microsoft Teams will be available for you. You can access the full course through the Udemy links in the description below, or you can connect with us to discuss providing this series directly to your organization. We wanted to provide you with another video from this series and chose to highlight how you can access your private and personal OneDrive work items from within the Teams environment. This feature in Teams shows this application is not just for teamwork. It allows you to work on your private work documents while staying connected to your organization through your calendar, your contacts, and work items. You can access all of your private OneDrive files directly within the Files application view, allowing you to complete your personal work items while remaining connected to your organization. When you select the OneDrive tab, your OneDrive will open within the Teams environment, allowing you to select and open all the different files or folders. You're able to edit your OneDrive files directly within Microsoft Teams. Any changes that you make within the edit mode are going to save automatically. Select Close in the top right to navigate back to your OneDrive in the Teams environment. You can create new folders to help you organize your OneDrive files by choosing the new dropdown and selecting Folder. Give the folder a name and choose Create. Your new folder is available in OneDrive. From here, you can create new private work items that will open in Teams, but will be saved to your personal OneDrive cloud storage. These new items will not be shared. Choose the new drop-down menu and select the type of item you'd like to create. Give that document a name. Choose Create, and the new document will open in Teams, allowing you to work on and build your new document while staying connected to your organization. Use the Upload drop-down menu to upload new files and folders into your personal OneDrive from your computer. Once you select an option, your file explorer will open, allowing you to locate the file or folder that you'd like to upload. Select the item and choose Open to begin uploading it. You can manage your files and folders by hovering over them and choosing the ellipsis that appears. You have access to many of the features and tools of OneDrive, such as Copy Link, Download, Delete, Rename, Move, and Copy. These are the same features we explored earlier in the section of the series that focuses on the Files tab of a Teams workspace. You can review the videos within that section to learn more about these options if needed. If you would like to access all of the features and tools of OneDrive, you can choose Open in OneDrive and the full application will open using your default web browser. We post new videos every Wednesday, so don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.